Mercury, the smallest planet in our solar system, has always been considered a quiet, scorched world. It's the planet closest to the Sun, with temperatures soaring above 400 degrees Celsius on its day side. But now, astronomers have discovered something truly remarkable about this tiny planet. It's actually shedding material into space, forming a massive tail. And this isn't just any tail, it's made of sodium atoms, stretching for millions of kilometers behind Mercury. Yes, you heard that right. Mercury, a rocky planet with almost no atmosphere, is acting a bit like a comet, releasing sodium into space. This isn't a one-time event either. It's happening regularly and is triggered by a combination of solar activity, micrometeoroid impacts, and Mercury's extreme surface conditions. In this video, we're going to explore exactly how this sodium tail forms, what causes it, and why it's such an exciting discovery for scientists. Whether you're into space exploration or just love a good cosmic mystery, you'll soon see why Mercury's sodium tail is a big deal in understanding planets and their environments. Now, let's break down how all this works. Scientists first confirmed Mercury's sodium tail back in 2001, but recent studies have shown just how huge and dynamic it really is. The sodium atoms forming this tail aren't coming from deep inside Mercury, they're actually being ejected from the planet's surface into space. This happens because of intense forces like solar radiation, which heats up the surface and high-speed micrometeoroids constantly bombarding Mercury. Imagine a planet so close to the Sun that its surface gets hotter than a blazing oven. This intense heat causes atoms on Mercury's surface to gain enough energy to break free and float off into space. This process is called thermal desorption, but that's not all. Mercury is also constantly being bombarded by micrometeoroids, tiny grains of space dust moving at incredibly high speeds. When these meteors strike the surface, they vaporize parts of it, launching more material into Mercury's super-thin atmosphere, which scientists call the exosphere. And once these sodium atoms are released, they don't just float around aimlessly, the sun's radiation pressure, like a solar wind, pushes them away from the planet, creating that long glowing tail. In fact, this tail can stretch as far as 24 million kilometers, about 60 times the distance between the Earth and the Moon. While this tail is invisible to the naked eye, special filters can detect the light emitted by the sodium atoms. When Mercury is closest to the Sun, the tail shines brightest, about 16 days before or after the planet reaches its perihelion, the closest point to the Sun in its orbit. During these times, the Sun's activity increases, causing more heat and radiation to reach Mercury's surface, which in turn enhances the sodium tail. Telescopes on Earth have captured incredible images of this phenomenon, especially during peak periods when the tail is at its brightest. Even NASA's MESSENGER spacecraft, which orbited Mercury from 2011 to 2015, collected tons of data on the planet's exosphere, helping scientists understand this mysterious tail better. Mercury's sodium tail is interesting for more than just its size, the way it's formed, gives scientists a glimpse into the invisible forces shaping planets. Mercury doesn't have a traditional atmosphere like Earth, where air molecules interact with each other. Instead, it has an exosphere, a super-thin layer of atoms that barely interact with one another. The solar wind, a stream of charged particles from the Sun, plays a big role in this process. Mercury has a weak magnetic field, just strong enough to deflect a little bit of the solar wind, but most of these energetic particles from the Sun hit Mercury's surface directly, causing a process called sputtering. In sputtering, particles from the solar wind knock atoms off the planet's surface, and sodium is especially vulnerable to this process. This discovery is also helping scientists understand the long-term effects of space weather, the gradual transformation of a planet's surface by solar and cosmic forces. Over millions of years, processes like these can reshape a planet's crust, affecting its surface chemistry, how reflective or dark it becomes, and even how hot it gets. This is especially important when it comes to studying planets in extreme environments, like Mercury. Looking ahead, there's an exciting mission on its way to Mercury that could answer even more questions.
The European Japanese Bepi Colombo mission, which is set to arrive at Mercury in 2026, will be studying the planet's surface, magnetic field, and exosphere in unprecedented detail. It will carry two orbiters with sensors designed to study Mercury's sodium emissions and how the planet's tail forms. This mission will give scientists the clearest picture yet of how Mercury's tail is created and how it evolves. So, while Mercury might be small, its sodium tail is proving to be a giant discovery in planetary science, it's changing the way we think about planets, even those with no atmosphere, no water, and extreme conditions. If you found this video interesting don't forget to subscribe for more deep dives into the mysteries of our solar system and beyond. Until next time, keep wondering, and keep looking up.